Welcome to this video where we'll be covering the Revit shared reference point. This is to ensure that the coordinate system used inside Civil Designer, which is the real world coordinate system, will be used in Revit as well. To speed things up, I've pre created a little CAD entities here with a line and some information. This is so that I can use the same information when I am inside Revit. Or if I am not using Revit myself, but I want to communicate to the person using Revit where I have clicked on the screen to indicate where the shared reference point must be used. To create a shared reference point inside Civil Designer, I will make sure that I'm in survey mode. I'll then go to File, Export, Revit Shared Reference Point. I'll click on the origin using one of the snap modes. This is currently using Southern Hemisphere coordinates, so I'll negate that and I'll make sure that I'm using meters. I then need to save this, so I'll quickly go over to my folder where I'm saving this and I'll call this Urban Revit Shared Ref Point. You really can call this anything you'd like, just so that you can remember where what the item's name is called. It's now told us that it has successfully written this file. We can go over to Revit where we have a, the model waiting. I'm now going to show you how to set up the shared reference point for Revit. This is in case the person using Revit, either the architect or the structural engineer, might have their own coordinate system for the project and they might need to move your project to that location on their drawing. If this happens, the survey system can be updated using the Revit shared reference point, which I'll show you how to use now. If you zoom into the little CAD item which I made earlier, and I encourage you to make it as well, especially if you are not going to be the person using the Revit model. It just helps with communicating where the item had taken place. If we go to add-ins and we go to import shared coordinates from XML file, if this is not located over here under the add-ins, you will need to download it from the Autodesk website. I can then go and click on the first point that I clicked on inside Civil Designer, and then I'll click on the second point that I clicked on inside Civil Designer. We'll then click on the item or the XML file, which I created inside Civil Designer, and we can click open. It'll ask us if we want to, are we sure that we want to use this new shared coordinate system and we'll say yes. And we'll press OK. The next step to take is to update the survey model default. So we'll go to manage, we'll go to location, we'll go to the site tab and we'll change to the urban revit shared reference point. We'll make that current and we'll press OK. We can then zoom out and test if this is now updated our coordinate system to match the CAD. We can go to annotate, spot coordinate, and we can then check if that is updated. Here you can see it is updated. I'll press escape and double click with the mouse. Thank you very much. I hope this will help you with getting the coordinate system correctly matching the CAD coordinate system. Have a great day further. Cheers for now.